I saw a post online that this year's WrestleMania, WrestleMania XL, WrestleMania 40 is gonna be the first year without Vince McMahon involved and I want to talk about that a little bit. I'm not sure how to clip one of these. Every time I'm doing a video, I'm just holding it like that. I think it's pretty comfortable, but some people would say it's a little bit unprofessional. So that's why I decided to clip it this time. If you want me to hold it, don't worry, I can hold it. No worries whatsoever. Next time, just tell me, tell me in the comments, what do you prefer and I'm gonna do it. First WrestleMania without Vince McMahon, WrestleMania 40, the monumental 40, the big XL. What are we doing here? Why Vince is not involved? We all know why Vince is not involved. It's because of the allegations and all that stuff. And I think he doesn't want to hurt the company in any capacity, but it's a little bit sad. It's truly an end of an era. And from SummerSlam 2022, Triple H is kind of in charge of everything, creative wise. And we have seen some great stuff in Triple H's uh, Triple H's regime, like the arrival of Damage Control, Pete Dunne returned his name, uh, the WrestleMania 40 main event got reworked because Triple H actually listened to the fans, or maybe this was the whole plan along, I don't know, but uh, yeah, we have seen some great stuff in tri with Triple H, and honestly, I pretty much trust the process from this point. I just, every time it's Monday or Friday or it's a live pay-per-view, I just know that I can sit on my behind and I can watch and trust the process and maybe even have the privilege to make a video afterwards about how cool is some story or whatever. And with all that credit, we cannot discredit Vince. Vince made wrestling what it is today. This gigantic thing, this billion dollar business that is worldwide. Because of Vince McMahon, I have people who are watching me from India, from Pakistan, from everywhere around the world. And people everywhere around the world know what wrestling is. No Undertaker, Rey Mysterio, Edge, Shawn Michaels, all of these people, even the girls. Can you imagine? Even the girls know these people and know what kind of wrestling is. So we gotta give credit to Vince. Yes, he had a couple of flops years ago. Do you guys remember what happened? All the McMahon family came out and they said, the power is in your hands now and nothing changed and that was funny and we have seen a lot of flops from Vince but I'm pretty sure that we're gonna see a lot of flops from Triple H in the following years as well but yeah it's really an end of an era and I wanted to make a video to acknowledge that and maybe we can share some sadness or maybe we can share some cool moments together from Vince McMahon he's not dead He's not dead, <laughs> he's not dead, he's just out of wrestling, at least for now. Maybe he's gonna come back at some point, who knows. But I already kind of miss him. We have so many great moments with him. And uh, as I said a couple of minutes ago, we know wrestling as it is today because of him. So yeah, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Yeah, I'm gonna see you in the next video.